Replacing a corroded or damaged TPMS valve stem is a simple process when using this kit. One benefit of ReCore is that you don't have to remove the wheel or tire from the vehicle, saving time and eliminating the need to reprogram the TPMS unit or potentially damaging it by demounting the tire. First, position the wheel to put the TPMS valve stem at either the 3 o'clock or the 9 o'clock position. This will help make drilling a straight hole easier. Support the vehicle with a jack or lift. Do not remove the TPMS sensor from the wheel. Remove the old valve core if present. You can use the valve core torque tool to try to remove it. If the core cannot be removed, use needle-nosed pliers to pull the core pin out. This can also be done using the special high-speed drill bit provided in the ReCore kit. Drill out the old valve stem until all of the cap threads are removed. This will also remove any remaining bits of the valve core. With the TPMS sensor at 3 or 9 o'clock, use the valve stem drill to enlarge the valve stem hole. Run the drill at high speed and sink the tool straight, slowly, and gently into the valve stem hole. Stop after all of the outer cap threads have been cut away from the existing valve stem. With the drill still spinning at high speed, keep the drill lightly engaged and pause momentarily before removing it in order to form a smooth, uniform surface around the rim of the valve stem. Use the tap and tap handle to cut inside threads into the valve stem in the drilled hole. Do not use cutting fluid or any liquid. As tapping becomes difficult, stop and reverse the tap out of the valve stem and clear the chips from it. Blow loose chips clear from the inside of the hole with an air gun. Apply thread lock sealant to the outside of the threads of the recourse sensor saver about 1 8 inch from the end that has no valve cap. Use the tip of the applicator bottle to spread it all the way around. Be sure to avoid contact with skin. Remove the valve cap and screw the recourse sensor saver into the TPMS valve stem and finger tighten until the two surfaces seat together against the O-ring. Then, finish tightening the recourse sensor saver with the valve core torque tool, rotating the tool clockwise until it clicks three times. This not only finishes tightening the ReCore sensor saver to its proper torque, it also ensures proper torque of the valve core. You have now completed the process of replacing the valve sensor, and your customer is back on the road and satisfied that you help them avoid the costly replacement of their TPMS unit.